What's going on, people on YouTube? It is your boy Obey Juice coming y'all with another banger, man. And um, yeah, bro, it's crazy because uh, a couple of days ago, just recently, I got my channel monetized. And let me tell you something, it's crazy, bro. Like dead ass, crazy. Um, so basically, um, uh, since my channel is monetized, I can start making some money from YouTube. And, um, you know, it's a bunch of YouTubers just out there that's explaining the, uh, you know, ways to get your CPM up, you know, um, the RPMs is something that you will have to pay attention to as well. Um, but yeah, it's just crazy, man, because now since my channel is monetized, I already have uh, a decent amount of subscribers. Um, my views is, you know, crazy, man, but um, so look, this is the thing I found out over the years of, uh, doing YouTube, um, basically what it is, is like, it's a trial and error. You're never going to get everything guaranteed. Like you might have to try, you know, um, other methods to get your channel to start being seen by, you know, Google or matter of fact, just say YouTube as a whole platform. Um, basically, uh, when I first started, what I did is, um, I was using Google ads and, uh, it was only on certain ads. It wasn't like all of my videos was just there, you know what I'm saying? Um, so, uh, I used to use Google ads to, you know, kind of help make my channel be seen. And, uh, from there on, I'm just letting you know, like from there on that junk took off. And then like, um, you know, I had a lot of impressions. People was just looking at like, I mean, looking at my channel because now my video is popping up like here, you know, go check out this guy. You know what I'm saying? And uh, it's crazy because I didn't expect it to actually work. And, um, you know, I got like so many videos on my uh, channel as of right now. And um, it's like a lot of Grand Theft Auto stuff that I did in the past years. Um, it's a bunch of... Uh, car meets that I did do on Grand Theft Auto. And then there was this video that was like trending on uh, my page. I don't know how many views it had when I last looked at it though, from using uh, Google ads to kind of help me out. Um, that uh, that shot up to like almost 50,000. And I'm like, whoa, that's a lot. You know, that's a lot of people. But still to this day, I have not like put anything on there. And it just still is growing by itself, which is crazy because um, that's probably going to be that one video that's going to be getting hit really hard. Um, so back to what I was saying. So, yeah, my channel is monetized. So now um, since it's monetized, uh, I'll basically show you guys how to uh, set it up once when you do, because um, basically once when you get monetized, it's so much easier now to um you know get your get your money um only thing is it's like you gotta really know what kind of niche you have with your channel because if you're just like uploading videos just to upload videos that's that's not gonna work um you gotta make sure that uh it's something that's like trendy like i mean even if you had the somewhat clickbait i mean you can do that too but you know, then you have to keep doing it. You know what I'm saying? Like, you just got to find something that fits your channel, fits what you're thinking about. And then once you stick with it, it's like now, you know, over time, you start seeing it, you know, go. But I'm going to tell you this much, keeping it 100. Um, most of the time, you would have to dead ass like promote your channel all the time. It wouldn't just be like no single, you know, boom, there you go. Um so yeah, it's crazy, man. It's like it's a lot involved with it, but the long term of it is, is just you know stay on your consistent schedule, upload like how you do, and then you'll be alright, man. You know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna uh, switch my you know screen so that way I can show you guys exactly how to set it up. And um, yeah, man, uh, this is crazy, dude. I didn't expect this to happen, but it did. And now I'm like, oh wow, this is crazy, dog. Like. Now I can actually start making some some money, you know what I'm saying? And yeah, hopefully uh over the next, you know, few years that I'll be like a really big YouTuber just playing video games and vlogging because that's what I do. So um I will get back with y'all in a little bit. And um, you know, obviously the screen is gonna be changed. So 
yeah so yeah this is my youtube channel um as you guys can see i have uh you know a decent amount of subscribers and that's just from using uh like i said you got a trial and error with youtube um basically uh with google ads um also playing a big role in my channel as well i'm not gonna lie i've been using it but it's not on all of my videos it's just on a specific uh type of video so like the grand theft auto ones that i probably have or the ones that's probably uh you know drawing attention to my page and whatnot but uh after a while i had to um i had to like stop using it because um it does help though it really does help but then the thing is, is that you got all these newer people that never seen your channel before. And if it's like something that's based off of tech or if it's uh, like a cooking recipe or, you know, um, um, some auto stuff. Like if you're looking at um, somebody do a clickbait on some Lamborghini that they probably taken delivery of or something like that. Right now, if you was to put it on uh, Google ads, right, most most of the time people are going to just watch the video because of that car but your watch time um and uh revenue doesn't really count because it's part of this um this part of the google ads so yeah you might get like a lot of views you might get a lot of people that's actually looking you know what i'm saying but um it, it it's like you're spending uh you know money on people who's clicking on the ads and then that's just how it goes but i mean that would be a good way to start off if you was trying to like you know boost up your impressions so people can see your channel more google ads is one way to do it legitly you know what i'm saying and you wouldn't have to worry about your channel being in risk of anything because you're just hey, saying hey you know this is an ad for whatever video it is and then people can go check it out um so yeah, when when you get uh monetized, um, you know, when you go to the monetize tab, I can't show you guys that because obviously when I go to it, it's not showing the steps and all this stuff. But one step would be that uh you would have to read their partner terms and stuff like that. Um, so you know what I'm saying YouTube basically saying in the uh the terms that they take 55% and then you keep 45%. It's basically math. I mean, you can't be upset with it, but it's like, as long as you're staying on your grind, you're consistent with your schedule and you know that you're gonna, um, you know, make it one day, then that's a good attitude to have because that's what you want. You wanna be, you wanna be, um, you know, excited to do videos and, you know, I mean, I understand life happens. Sometimes things can get a little crazy, but, um, the main thing is is uh staying on a consistent schedule so basically after you do the first one which is reading the um the partner terms then you will go ahead and link an adsense account basically that's just how you get paid especially if you hit a billing threshold of a hundred dollars you know what i'm saying every time you keep hitting a hundred dollars you basically get in more money it works just like that um so uh, setting that up, I you know, obviously you can go look it up on YouTube, uh, how to set it up. It's not really hard. It takes like five to 10 minutes, but um, the process for them to actually review and make sure that it's legitly you, um, that takes a couple days. So you probably be expecting like a good two to three days if you uh, set it up and whatnot. And then once when they review it, they'll send you an email, um, you know, stating that it's good to go. And uh I think I had something too that went in the mail, but um, yeah, dude. So like you're just you're just getting this set up, and then the third step is basically them looking at your channel, and then once when they look at your channel, now they're seeing um everything that you uploaded, and you know just making sure that you know your titles isn't crazy, um, making sure that your content is is good. They're also looking at uh your highest viewed video. So if you got a video that's like, you know, trending and it's doing really well, you know what I'm saying? That's awesome. So now the the last and final thing, once when you're approved, this is what your screen will look like, right? And um, also too, in your email, they will send this to you, you know, stating that, you're, uh, that you've been accepted. So now you're probably like, man. I'm accepted now. I can go ahead and start making money. But wait, just hold on right there, bro, because y'all 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 gotta realize something. So once when you once when you get monetized, right? Um, 
now you can basically set up. So your dashboard suddenly changes, right? I have vidIQ. I've been using vidIQ for a long time and also uh, TubeBuddy. Those two has been helping me with my keyword uh, tool. So that way when I upload videos, um, instead of me trying to like think of a tag, I can just go ahead and, you know, do that. So um, when you go to your content tab, right, all of a sudden now you see that you have monetization on everything, right? And I mean, yeah, you know, like my views are a little iffy because of the fact that certain videos that I do post, it might get, you know, more traffic somehow. And then some videos just might not do so well. So it's kind of like a roller coaster. But when you, uh, when you get monetized, I'm gonna just show you, um, let me see. So like this one, for example, I, I, I got these last three videos and whatnot, but, um, so if you was to go to, um, look at like a video that you have, let's just say something like this, like, okay, it might not have a lot of views, but this is the thing that changes, right? So you see your overview, your reach, the engagement, the audience, the revenue. Now the revenue is going to be something different that's on there that you never saw uh, before. And you know what I'm saying? I'm not really worried about the view duration because People sometimes will watch the videos and then they'll just click off of them joints and it's just what it is. Um, I do play a lot of Forza, so you know what I'm saying? That's basically what that is. But anyway, um, you got, uh, here I'll show you. So this video I did an hour long and I basically got 2.1 watch hours and like, uh, you know what I'm saying? Like all of this is just recommended from YouTube. So basically this video is so long because i asked uh my um i did like a little poll and i asked all my fans like hey what do you guys want to see do y'all want to see like shorter videos or longer videos and i did like a long video just for an hour long just to see what was going to happen and then this happened and i'm like wow this is crazy you know what i'm saying like i didn't expect this to to pop off like that so then um uh the thing is though once when you get monetized back to the revenue stuff so you have your estimated revenue that you made from that video then you have your rpms and then you have your cpms so um uh, basically uh the cpm is how many times people like click on the video and then play it back so like if somebody's uh you know watching your video over and over and over again and you know you got ads like spread it out throughout the whole video like this is an hour long so you know i got like at least five or six ads just going through it don't be afraid to even place ads either because that's going to be the first mistake you do just go ahead and put them joints where you know it's a break um in you know in the video and then you'll be all right man don't don't worry about it so anyway um then you have your rpms basically you know how like when you drive in a car and you just got you sitting at idle and then all of a sudden it just starts going up and then you see red line pretty much. So if your channel is really, 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 really doing good, like I'm talking, you're just, you're, you're uploading a video and in a couple minutes, it's like, boom, there you go. A few thousand views. Um, if people are watching your video and I mean, at a very, very, very fast rate and they're just clicking on it, like no tomorrow. That's good because now your RPMs is up. And when your RPMs is up, your money goes up. Cause now you're not, uh, you know, seeing like a small, um, you know, uh, dollar amount. So kind of like your CPMs and RPMs go together, you know what I'm saying? But not all the way. Um, you just gotta make sure that you have a video that's um, appealing to other people. And it's a certain niche that you got to do with that. And if you stick with it, I mean, dude, you're basically in the green. And, um, you know, I just hope that everybody else can do the same thing I'm doing because uh, it's not like it's not hard, but it is in a way you just got to motivate yourself to do good and you'll be all right. So, um, yeah, if you uh, if you did enjoy the video, just give me a thumbs up and um, you know, subscribe and I will greatly appreciate it. But yeah, um, I'm just letting you guys know that I'm officially monetized now. So this is going to be dope for me. And um, I can't wait to see what next year brings because now it's just staying on a consistent upload, going ham and just tackling this. And uh, yeah, I should see like a big, you know,
I, I would say like one day I want to be a big YouTuber, you know what I'm saying? And it'll be awesome to have that happen. But yeah, uh, it's your boy Obey Juice signing out. Peace.